Welcome to the Found Lore Show. My name's Ryan. I'm John. Matt. I'm Mike. Chris. This is our work. This is our show. What our group consists of is three brothers and two roommates who have collectively come together on a weekly, almost daily basis to share tools and time and energy and creativity. We've been working together as creative cohorts and just best of friends. We've been uh, having the best time of it, but we're all centered around one house that's along the freeway in St. Paul. Um, in our backyard, there's a big windmill and a garden, and our scene is all about community. And we like to make our what we're doing is not necessarily folklore in the tradi traditional sense, but we think we do our own thing as artists and think that the best uh, terminology for that would probably have something to do with Americana, folklore, that kind of thing. So we've, we've kind of thrown that term around amongst ourselves a lot. And the idea of found came up because we use a lot of found object. We combined folklore with found and got found lore. Thank you, Matt, for the found concept. And one thing that's kind of cool about the work we're doing is everybody's got such unique styles, and we all use a lot of found objects, and so we're always going out looking for different things. And so we know um, what different members from the gallery, what they can use or can't use. So somebody's always bringing treasure or something to work with to the gallery, or our studio, and it's really fun because it feeds uh, the uh, imagination and creativity for everybody. I think a lot of what happens in contemporary settings is, is the fact that it takes maybe 10 years uh, for us to fall back and really understand what has just happened. So when you follow up an art history, you flip through these books, you look at contemporary artists, and you're inspired by every single one of them. Everyone was inspired by all the artists before them. We're following traditions. Uh, some of it you might have seen done in the past, and we hope so. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying to emulate some of our heroes. And if that's uh, an icon or a symbol uh, out of the back of our heads, the smiley face, or if it's a crate, or if it's a bottle, or a piece of wood that says something to you. If it speaks to you and you want that object around you, it's probably on the level of what we're thinking about. Everyday objects that have been re, re yeah. There's wood carvings, there's uh, collages, there's assemblages and paintings and photography. There's something for everybody. So yeah, come on, down. come on down, check it out. Found objects and folk art, you're going to love it. Come on, Fine Art Center, April 2nd. Come yep. on down. See ya here. <laughs>